Go interactive with Fiona. Mafeo Sutton Park is so beautiful during the summer. And making it even more spectacular are the nine public art pieces that have been installed. But all this art's got me wondering, what is the story behind each piece? What kind of fish do you think those are on the bridge? Uh, hmm. Good question. I don't know anything about fish. They kind of look half a uh, whale. I'll take a wild guess and I'll say salmon. Salmon? Salmon? Salmon, maybe. I would think so that they're salmon as well, since we're known for salmon, right? Hey there, my name is Laura Timmermans, and I'm the artist for Salmon on the Bridge down here at Swailana Lagoon. Salmon on the Bridge celebrates the importance of salmon in our world and on our oceans here on the coast of British Columbia. For 2016, we had nine artists that were selected, and we've spread their artwork out through the, the Harbourfront walkway. Every city should have something like this, and the public art is, is just beautiful to look at. I chose salmon because salmon is a shared value that we along the coast of British Columbia and Vancouver Island really all connect with. What do you think that the salmon are doing? It looks like they're jumping with the bridge. Eating some seaweed? The salmon swimming on the bridge are all interconnected with the feeder fish, so herring, sardines, and they are the sub-level for what they all feed on. What do you think that the circular thing is in the center? That I have no idea. A fish egg? The sun. I'm just going to take a guess and say it's a peace medallion. Balls of herring come uh, like in the bay here a lot and then the salmon come in and feed. The salmon are swimming into the center of the bridge and in the center of the bridge is a central herring ball and herring is a keystone feeder fish in our ecosystem. Now have you ever been to this park when it was raining? I just live in the old quarter so I do walk down here regularly. Did you notice anything? on the bridge? No, this is the first time I've been here. When you are walking along the bridge, you look below your feet, and on the concrete I've painted hydrophobic paint, which basically means water-resistant paint. So it's invisible when it's dry, but when it's wet, you come down and the paint beads off the water and you can see the pattern of salmon swimming on the bridge. I think we better give this a try for ourselves. What do you yeah. think? Yeah! This represents the importance of rain to our salmon and to the whole coastal ecosystem. That's a brilliant idea. Oh, that is so cool. That is really neat. Well, they better bring a water bucket if they want to <laughs> see everything. I'm actually excited to come when it's raining now. <laughs> Nationally, we're known as a city that really supports arts and culture and supports artists. And this temporary program showcases that support. And artists want to come here and, and showcase their artwork and display it to a community that really embraces it. People won't take a cool picture in a museum, but they'll take a picture next to a cool piece of art in the park. Not everybody can afford to go to museums and stuff, so I think it's great if it's free anywhere. Would you like to take a cool picture together next to the piece of art? Why not? One, two, 